it. Beautiful. pretty much just about at the top right now I got up here a lot faster than I thought I think it only really took me about an hour and I got I don't know like 30 pounds worth of camera gear so just trying to uh, replenish the old stocks just waiting for the Sun to rise now I can see dawn coming over the horizon now you have this like red glow in the sky so just kind of waiting it out behind this rock just trying to stay warm and uh, yeah, I think it's going to be good once the sun comes up. Pretty excited. Uh, yeah, I'm glad I got up here early because I can just kind of catch my breath, relax, really think about what I'm doing. right on this outcrop overlooking the lake and I'm shooting towards the light just while we have some really nice light right now uh, it's not the best view but I know as soon as the Sun rises and breaks the horizon I'm gonna get perfect side lighting for the lake and the heart-shaped island and right now you can see some low-hanging fog I hope that sticks around and uh, yeah hopefully I'll get an incredible shot there that was that was kind of the goal the plan at least so so I'm just posted up here. I guess you can see, uh, you can kind of see the dawn light. We got some beautiful light. You can kind of see the fog down there. And the lake just goes off to the horizon. We got the moon. someone was within the frame to give a sense of scale um, there's this rocky outcrop and if someone was standing there it would just make an unreal composition without a person or a sense of scale I mean it's still a good composition because we're high enough that you can you can see the valley and you can see all the fog and it looks great but it's really not that far I really want to just run over there and put this on automatic timer but Right now the light's going so fast, I'm like, I better not. I don't want to be too rushed, but uh, yeah, absolutely stunning right now. Um, I've already been taking several compositions. I think I got some better B-roll for you guys to see so you can get a better idea of what's going on up here. Yeah, all in all, it's just an incredible morning for sure. Hopefully you guys can hear me okay um, it's really windy up here man this place is just it's ridiculous like there's so much to shoot up here as a photographer it's a dream I mean there's an island uh, that's shaped like a heart there's a valley that just snakes out into the horizon obviously today I just got perfect conditions like the color is just absolutely amazing we have fall colors the conditions are just ridiculous <laughs> 
But uh, yeah, absolutely incredible. I've just been sitting up here, tripod, just in the same position, just kind of almost 180 degree view of just all these different little compositions just picking away. And uh, yeah, it's just absolutely incredible. You can kind of get a better feel for what's going on. Just absolutely ridiculous. Just absolutely stunning. You can see I got the old camera set up right on the ledge here. Holy frig. Just looking at it almost gives me a heart attack. Conditions are still pretty favorable for some photography, so I'm just picking out little shots here and here. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I can't even talk because I'm so excited. Holy! I think my body's finally starting to realize how cold it is too. It's really windy up here. My fingers are just cold. I'm getting hungry, and it's just picking away at different shots. You lose track of uh, how you're really feeling. But wow, just what an incredible morning, all in all. I hope that I got enough B-roll and footage to show you guys just how incredible. Uh, this morning was here atop Mount Sagamok, Sagam Sagamook, Sagamok. I don't know. I'm gonna go try to find some shelter away from this wind. Just try to warm up for a bit. Maybe have another snack, and then probably just come back up here, pull out the 70 to 200, and just pick away at different little compositions. I still haven't gotten a really good shot of the heart-shaped island because the fog's just really heavy. But I'm definitely getting some cool shots here and there, just of the fog sweeping over the orange autumn colors it's, it's just absolutely amazing But yeah, I think I'm going to close out the video here. Um, I hope you guys really enjoyed the video. If you liked the video, go ahead, like it. If you like the content, then feel free to subscribe. I hope that this inspired you guys to come explore Mount Sagamok or climb Mount Sagamok. If you have the, the courage to, I would really encourage you to get up at 4.30 or 5 in the morning and hike it and, and be here for these beautiful conditions right at sunrise. It's, it's absolutely stunning. but. Even here early morning or even during the day, I'm sure it's still just as beautiful. But yeah, I really hope that this inspired you guys to come check out Mount Sagamok for yourself. Come hike it and explore it. It's absolutely stunning. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope it inspired you. And uh, I'll see you in the next video.